Hey guys, welcome to JMOF Pickup. I've got Sunny Arvado today from uh, strengthbysunny.com. Uh, we want to basically introduce him. He's been on a bunch of my videos before. We did a podcast on my channel. We did uh, some collabs about how he's helping with, with fitness and stuff like that. He's been in the background a few times. He's been uh, really coaching me through a bunch of the fitness stuff. Um, what a lot of you guys may not know is that Sunny is actually one of the top authorities on the dating and pickup stuff as well. Um, we've known each other back since like mid 2012. And I remember he came to visit in Vegas early 2013. And I think just in that weekend alone, we pulled 11 girls between just the two of us. And we, we were, him and I used to basically, for those of you that are like, have been in the game for a while, we were like the superstars on RST Nation, which is Real Social Dynamics' main forum and message board. Um, he was only one Kong, I was j -Molf, and we basically dominated the front page of that board and a lot of people still recognize us now that we're kind of like back on YouTube and shit like that and really pushing our brands a lot more these days. A lot of guys are like, dude, you guys had legendary posts from 2012 and 2013 and all that stuff. Um, but he's also incorporated along with the dating and pickup stuff. He's incorporated a whole bunch of stuff about building a personal brand, about fitness and bodybuilding, about, you know, balancing out all the other stuff besides the dating and like bringing a lot to the table and making sure that you're like a yes for the girl and not, you know, because as I've said before, if you're not an alpha dude, if you're not a confident dude, if you're not, you know, coming across as like a cool dude and not faking it through outer game tactics, all the strategies and all the tactics and stuff in the world aren't going to help you. It's going to be really hard for you to, because the chick's going to size you up pretty fast and she's going to be like, no, that guy's just, you know, reeking of beta behavior. And then these guys are like, oh, well, I'm, I'm implementing all these things you taught me how to do, like why isn't it working? It's because you didn't get this other shit handled. So I'm going to let him uh, introduce himself formally and kind of give a little bit of talk about himself and then we're going to go over a uh, collaboration we're going to be doing. So, uh, What's going on fellas? Sonny here, Strength by Sonny. Um, yeah, again, grateful to be on Jay Mole's uh, YouTube channel again, grateful for you guys tuning in here. Um, oh, so we got the audio fixed. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, a little bit about me as far as uh, from a dating standpoint, you know, I, you know, my story is pretty much known at this point. Um, I, I wasn't necessarily someone who struggled right off the beginning. I just, I always had strong masculine role models. I actually posted a picture of them the other day on my Instagram. Uh, my father and my uncle, they kind of, you know, molded me and guided me along the years, um, throughout the years, and uh, they really helped me out. And eventually, you know, once I, once I finished up uh, college and grad school, I kind of, I kind of stumbled on this side of the internet. And, you know, it's definitely, it's an industry that, Definitely interests me. Eventually, I established my own brand, my own website, strengthbysunny.com, and I haven't stopped since then. For four years now, I've been helping guys all over the world work on a variety of things. Um, obviously, the fitness stuff, but also the dating and personal branding stuff. But as far as the dating stuff is concerned, um, I pretty much I teach guys. I, I try to teach guys what I learned growing up. You are a personal brand competing in the business of people. You have to make that brand as valuable as possible so that everybody takes you seriously. Men take you seriously and respect you. Women take you seriously and respect you and want to fuck you. And then that's how you live a happy social existence. What, um, they, what they refer to in the game world is like SMV, social yeah. market value. Yeah. Like you work on maximizing and optimizing. Yes. I, so yes, I, these, these metrics that women use to assess a man's value those are the things throughout the years I've helped guys hammer those things, concentrate on those things, and then get results that way. It's a very effective system when you think about it. Um, and that's why I truly believe, I think everything flows from the health and fitness. Um, when you have a, a, a strong, physically fit body, this signals, this signals value to a woman. I think everything flows from there. You feel, you feel better, you, you feel healthier, you, you look better. You're more confident in yourself and women respond to you better. And I think a lot of things uh, flow from there. And obviously the, actually I just, you know, people sometimes they think, um, I, I forget the term someone used. Sometimes they want to say like, oh yeah, Sonny, you just use like Jersey Shore Guido or a glorified chess bra game. And no, not, it's not that at all. I mean, yeah, that is a big part of it too, but I, I also possess an analytical part to my mind as well. And that's evident. I just wrote an article on this. It was like 6,300 words, 100 night game uh, and party scene situations and how to deal with them. That's coming from someone 
with the strategist's mind, someone who has yeah. a, possesses an analytical part to their mind. Well, yeah, we'll link that article below. Yeah, he goes okay. through a hundred different situations uh, you can find yourself yeah. in like in interactions. And, and we we talked, we were joking the other day, how like unless you've been through like all the shit like we have that we've seen in game, you know, we've both been with several hundred chicks and seen all you know everything basically at this point. Yeah. So there's certain categories of situations you can fall into. We know exactly yeah. how to deal with them just mm -hmm. from experience, from talking to other top guys, from trying out stuff and kind of refining it and refining it. Um, whereas for a lot of you guys, you're gonna run into these situations and you're not gonna know what to do or you're gonna handle it suboptimally. So that article is really good to kind of give you a game plan for when you run into these major categories of situations. Um, so yeah, in terms of the, oh, oh yeah, I wanted to touch on too, the, uh, what he was talking about, how everything stems from the health and the fitness. Mm -hmm. I was able to crack 800 without ever really getting too big, but now what I've noticed, we're only, what is this, week seven right now? Yes. I started, I started January, January 1st, I've said in other videos, at 195 pounds, for your Europeans, uh, do the conversion on that to your system, 195 pounds at six foot four. Now I'm currently 218 at six foot four. My height hasn't changed. Um, but, we're both noticing, it's not just in my head, like he's noticed too, like mm -hmm. if I'm wearing a tank top, like I'm not fucking jacked yet, but if I'm like in a tank top or something, we've been in like a supermarket or restaurants or um, even at the gym, which is kind of surprising to me because I've, I've always been like the small guy in the gym in the past um, when I have made little shitty efforts to get bigger. Um, mostly because I was doing it wrong in the past and I just give up like most people because it wasn't progressing um yeah like these, i'm seeing chicks like staring at me or like eye fucking me which didn't used to have that would happen once in a while before um but now it's happening and you you even notice it yourself and we're only on week seven so um at, at another month or two and it's going to be even more pronounced i'm going to be even stronger and have even bigger muscles and stuff like that and you know i've, I've known for a while chicks are attracted to like the what is it wide shoulders what is it for mm -hmm. that they're attracted to in men? It's the shoulders, the waist. Yeah, shit. frame, wide shoulders, flaring lats. Um, the that's V all, taper, the V taper. Yeah, that's all. And I do have a program called the V taper, which you might want to check out too. Yeah, that's all evolutionary. Evolutionary. Yeah. It's like uh, you know we see big tits and ass. Yeah. It's like oh, that she can provide for the young. Yeah, because these are biomarkers of prime sexual health. Biomarkers of they indicate sexual dimorphism. I I, I said a joke the other day in, in your Facebook group. You know, um, what makes you you know? It's not Cindy's game. Just some random girl city. It's not Cindy's game that are attracting you when you're looking at her. You're not looking at her and saying, "Wow, she she, she looks like she has a good game of confidence." No, it's these biomarkers of health. Her fucking big tits, slim waist, and nice ass and legs. Same thing when women look at guys. So when you combine what we're doing with James, we're truly making a monster here because when you combine his non-optimized game with no fitness involved, now we're adding the fitness on top of that. We really are creating a different creature here. Yeah, we're gonna hit some countries that also um, value Americans and value, you know, a bunch of other stuff. When you're a foreigner in the land, you have even more of an advantage. So it's, it's kind of like, mm -hmm. you know, developing all this skill and then taking a jack body in countries that are mm -hmm. receptive to Americans. So it's just gonna be all out and plus good wings. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a, a massacre. So uh, to get into our collaboration, so the two of us used to run a lot of live programs independently in the past. Um, back in 2013, 2014, I was running programs like two or three weekends out of, out of the month. And then we both kind of got into other projects. He wrote a book, um, we can link that too. It's called Tyrants and Tellers. It's mm -hmm. about um, fighting the war against men, mm -hmm. cultural and- uh, Taking control of your life, being a masculine man mm -hmm. and going from there, yep. Yeah. So, you know, he's been involved with that. I've been involved with non-dating, non-pickup stuff, uh, affiliate marketing, traveling a bunch, that kind of stuff. Um, but we decided that, you know, since I'm working with him on all this health and fitness stuff, we're hanging out all the time, why don't we team up and bring all his personal brand stuff and his dating expertise as well, because he's one of the top guys I know on the dating stuff as well. Bring all that together, combine it into not just a, a traditional like three-day night game boot camp, but 
like kind of like what were you referring to it as? I was referring to it as a lifestyle workshop or a lifestyle program because literally anything that a guy would want to know, a guy would want to improve, anything that's going to improve his value, in addition to going out and hunting puss, go out and do that with the two top guys in the game right now. Yeah. Jay Mulf, I his reputation speaks for itself. I mean, what you know, eight hundred something chicks. I'm pretty much I'm up there too. Um, just two, yeah. Eight or nine hundred, yeah. <laughs> you know, two different. What what the value in this is that you have two very different approaches for the most part. His very highly analytical, just very much like a like a strategist. Computer. Yeah, exactly, the human computer. And then you have mine, very much focused on SFV, focusing on building that high value brand, social market value. Yeah. In addition to that, I also have a bit of a strategist mind as evidence that evidence in that article that we just mentioned before. Combining these two styles of getting chicks, optimizing your personal brand's value, and then you you just have you have the dynamic do it to take you to take it home for you. Yeah, so you can expect all the traditional elements of a boot camp where we have the three nights out on a Thursday, Friday, Saturday night. Mm -hmm. We're also gonna add in all the daytime stuff. And we're also going to add in all the like daytime approaching and all the lifestyle stuff, mm -hmm. yeah. optimizing your. SMG. Yeah, these past couple of months, I've taken more of a, of a uh, taken on more of a mindset of like an image consultant. So I've been reading a lot of books on like plastic surgery, um, uh, personal like look improving someone's personal image um, by any means necessary. That's the mindset that's also going to be involved in this. Yeah. Yeah. So okay, in terms of the time frame, today is um, what the fifteenth. February fifteenth. Yeah, yeah, today is the fifteenth. Um, he used to live in Austin, and there's a big event coming up. Was it March? Oh, South by Southwest, March 9th through March 18th. Should those people? Obviously. If we get interest for that, oh god, that's going to be incredible <laughs> because Austin, yeah, you you know, well, I'll tell you more about Austin another time. But fucking Austin, Texas, man, I truly believe that is. The, if you want to get slay hot puss on a regular basis, I believe, I truly believe Austin, Texas, that Central Texas area is the best uh, part of the country. Now you have that, Austin by itself, throw in a million plus tourists out of there for all the music and tech, the tech, the tech conventions and the music festivals, and it's just non-stop fucking chaos. 6th Street, it's just, it's pure insanity. I have my own personal stories. When I first moved to Austin, um, my first South by Southwest, that was, there was pure fucking chaos. Now a week? It's good all week or what? Uh, yeah, it's just it's insane. You have people so, like yeah, people might, like blatantly like drink like drinking in public and stuff. It's it's yeah. fucking nuts. We might, we might even be able to do. Uh, I would I would love to do something. If there's enough interest, I would. I'm there in a fucking second. Oh, I love South by Southwest so much, and just <laughs> the level of talent that's there. Oh yeah. my fucking god. What I was gonna say is we originally planned to just do three day programs, but now that I think about it, we could even do a week long there. Yeah, if for South by South, what that's gonna be fucking nuts. I'll tell you, that's something you're gonna want to prep like a week before that. Just Prep on sleep because it's gonna be nonstop. Yeah. It's just gonna be fucking. There's gonna be fucking snail trails slithering all over Sixth Street all day and night long. Seem, seem pretty excited. Oh uh, God, <laughs> I, yeah. I fuck it. If no one's interested, I might fucking go myself. All right, so <clears throat> no, I've been, I've been getting hit up a lot actually over the, the yeah. past months, and, and he has too. Are you guys running live program? Are you running live programs? Or yeah. And usually I say no because I'm focused on a bunch of other shit, and so is he. Yeah. But now we're coming together. So this is going to be kind of a limited time opportunity where we're only going to do these. We're considering Austin for March. We're considering um, we, April. We already have guys. Yeah, we already, got, we already got two guys for an April program. This is before we even announced it. So yeah. Two guys want to do it around the same weekend. So we're planning uh, for sure in New York City, um, April 19th, 20th, and 21st. Mm -hmm. I mean, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yeah. Uh, we've already got two students on there. We're going to probably cap each program at six people. So there'll be three of you for each one of us. Mm -hmm. you'll, you'll get exposure with both of us plenty. Uh, we'll probably bring an advanced friend or two on the program as well. So there'll probably be three very advanced guys uh, teaching up to six guys, but that's that's just the max, you know, depending on. Yeah. Um, we might only have four, so I don't think there's gonna be six guaranteed. It's whoever signs up. Um, in terms of the pricing, contact us. It's gonna be very uh, reasonable and competitive versus what's out there and, and what we're offering. Um, keep in mind, we, we are we firmly believe and we back that up with the results of our students and our own results that we're two of the best guys in this right now. And then in terms of the you know the surface area of what we're covering between the two of us, it's, it's going to be a you know pretty unbeatable experience. Mm -hmm. 
Um, so that's New York City. You also yeah, said City. DC might be yeah, on Yeah, DC, there. we have some shoots for uh, the end of April. That's going to be the following weekend. So that's going to be the 26th, 27th, 28th, Thursday, Friday, Saturday as well. Um, but, you know, we are open up until, you know, we're going to be doing some other stuff starting around mid-June. So kind of between now, so middle of February and mid-June, these four months, um, we're kind of playing Austin that one week in March, um, New York, and then DC mm -hmm. for the third and fourth weeks of April. Yeah. But we're open to suggestions if you guys want to do one. You know, good cities to do it are Miami, LA, Vegas, mm -hmm. um, or if you want to just do it in your hometown and we can get enough interest in that. You know, because there's a bunch of guys that, that don't care like where they do it and they'll fly mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Just hit us up because these spots are going to go pretty fast. And once you know programs capped, we're not going to just overload it. Yeah. So I'm going to have my email on the bottom. You can contact me, or you can contact him. We'll put his email on the bottom as well. Mm -hmm. And yeah, just hit us up. We can go over much more detail with you and talk about the pricing and basically to lock in your spot. We're going to need a five hundred dollar deposit, and that could be paid over PayPal. So you know your deposit is safe and all that stuff. You know we've both been teaching programs for five years, so. It's coming from a lot of experience and a lot of a lot of quality. We've turned out a lot of really, really top guys in this. A lot of my students from a few years ago are now on the two or three hundred count. So, is there anything else to add to that? I think that's it. Um, uh, one thing I would add, yeah, J Mom and I, we've you know we've taught on our own for years. We kind of. Even though we backed off it over the past like year, two years, we still get you know regularly people hitting us up to do it. We just we haven't gotten around to doing it. Now we made the commitment. Listen, um, we're both here. We're, we're hanging out with each other pretty much every day. Um, we, there probably isn't going to be another opportunity when we decide to work with guys in person. This really is something that you know it's on the table for the next couple months. So if you're if you're concerned working with either me or him, why not work with us together? Um, it, it'd be like you said, it would be a, a very valuable experience, something yeah. unlike anything anyone else yeah. has to offer. Yeah, for those of you, like a lot of a lot of people are skeptical that haven't done a boot camp before or whatever, they say, oh, how much can you really learn in three days? Or they've taken one with the RSD or some of these other companies, and keep in mind, those companies want to you know, like have you as a lifetime customer. So I, I hear guys like took seven RSD boot camps and they still suck, and they're like, what's going on? I'm like, dude, like, if you master this, or if you master it from one of their products, you're gone as a customer. That you can't, they can't sell you any more shit. Where, whereas we have the reverse mentality. We're not even in this for the money. We both have successful businesses apart from pickup. Um, we just, it, it gets annoying watching all the yeah. people suck in the community and watching them come out of these programs and still sucking and being frustrated and stuff like that. And we kind of enjoy transforming lives in a real way and actually getting people to solve this problem for real. So our philosophy is we never want you as a customer again. Of course, we're there for questions yeah. and to guide you along. You yeah, know. this isn't a matter of great, great, I got your money, go, now go fuck yourself. No, 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 like, no, no we're still something. accessible for questions. Yeah. But we want to, at the end of that program, we really want to have you be transformed. And the way we do that in three days is, like in terms of the pickup side, like, I can speak to that. Like, I'm a firm believer that it's not all about, as other companies say, doing a thousand nights out or a thousand approaches or you know all these going through all these different scenarios no i'm going to teach you on the first night here's how you pull for life in full detail <laughs> and very often guys are pulling on the first time of my program and they're like wow i've taken all these other programs i've studied all these products i've been on the forums for years and i've never been able to pull something i can pull yeah working with us in person this isn't a an opportunity to get better game or get better reactions from chicks. No, 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 no. I, yeah. no, no, no. This is very much a hunterman, a hunter or a fisherman. I, I actually look at getting chicks like from the point of view from a fisherman. No, no, no. Like this is about getting fucking laid. This is about. It's like you know when I grew up uh, learning fish with my uncle. No, no, no. This isn't about spending a nice day out on the water. I want a fucking boat full of fucking fish. Yeah, we don't. Same thing applies. No, no, no. I want, I want a fucking phone full of fucking puss ready to go. I want, I want to be pulling fucking puss left and right. Yeah, we don't. That's my mentality. That's our both our mentalities. Anytime we go out, anytime we take people clients out, we're, it's about pulling puss and getting fucking laid. Yeah, make no mistake about that. We don't want to be at the diner. At where I am talking about game and shit. Yeah. We want you all to be, uh, you know, whoever's on the program at home fucking. Right? Yeah. So, 
Yeah, that's a successful program when it's just everybody that we have on program is out fucking, fucking, you know, with a chick. Yeah, so I ran this one program in Vegas where the guy, he pulled like his second set on the first night and then he pulled again on the second night and then he pulled again on the third night and he closed all three nights. And this is a guy that didn't want to pull before and he was like so shocked because he had like washed all these products before, he had taken all these live programs with other companies, he had been on the forums, he had been part of his WhatsApp and group me chats, I'm sure you guys can relate to all this shit. And what happened over all these years, he still sucked because no one taught him the fundamentals of how to run a night game interaction and how to pull and all the little intricacies that go along with that. So I taught him that, he was able to do it on night one. And I remember he was texting me when he was back at this chick's room and he had already fucked her and he's like, dude, like she wants to like keep fucking more, I don't know if I should come back and I was like, like to learn more from the program, he's like, I want to get the value out of the program, like, it's up to you man. And he ended up like staying and banging her the whole night and then he still pulled nights two and three and then he was able to pull for his whole life, right? So like we don't want you guys to come back and have to take another program with us because that means we failed to do our job, right? We want to make it so you can pull consistently so that you can utilize Sonny's knowledge and get your SMV maximized and you can be the most attractive man to these girls, all right? And that's how we can do it in these three days because we're just gonna give you straightforward, practical, no bullshit, easy to assimilate stuff where you can take it on night one and pull, you can take it a year later and pull. You can know straight up without, you know, we're not gonna sugarcoat anything. Here's your weaknesses, here's what you need to do, here's what you need to fix, and now it's on you to fucking make those changes. Um, so that's pretty much it. So we will put in the bottom uh, the description for the video, we will put the links to our emails, okay? So you can email me or email Sunny. We talked about uh, Austin for March, New York and DC for April, but feel free to suggest other cities. Mm -hmm. And then we will put the link to his 100 uh, night game situations mm -hmm. and the um, his Tyrants and Tellers book mm -hmm. as well. Um, you have anything else to add? No, that's it. You know, just thank you very much for uh, for taking the time to watch this. I'm very excited, very excited to be working with j -Mold. I've known him for about five, six years now. Um, yeah, I'm very excited, especially the guys that choose to that choose to work with us. This really is uh, a once in a lifetime opportunity because we're not we're not doing the the scammy internet marketing thing where we're gonna be like, uh, you know, having that pressure on you. No, no, no. This is the last time. This is the last time. No, no, no. Like this really is like for a couple months um, because that's that's the truth about it. You know, Jay Molf and I, you know, on our own, we've coached guys for years. Um, we've kind of taken a step back over the past couple of years. Um, to this day, still get hit up um, with opportunities or guys that want to work with us, but. Um, in person, uh, I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, Jay Mole, you know, in addition to one of the guys that I respect, he's someone um, I consider a close friend over the past couple of years, and it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great working with someone that that the two of us working together. We both bring a lot of value to the table in in, in our own unique ways, and just anybody that works with us at the same time, it's it's something that can't be beat. It's a dynamic duo. Yeah, that we, can't we've, be beat. we've seen so much. Yeah. Um, you know, we've seen the whole gamut of clients before, so we can spot like, right away, like you're gonna go in and we're gonna know exactly what your problems are, like really like one or two interactions, because we've just seen, it's typically the same problems that most guys have over and over and over, and no one's correcting them. So they're continuing to make, like your sets, your interactions are failing at certain points repeatedly. Like if, if we were to take data on like 100 of your interactions or 500 of your interactions, there's like, significant weak points going from approaching all the way to closing and we're going to be able to spot those and spot exactly why they're happening and you're going to be able to course correct right away that's the value mm -hmm. of the live training yeah you know you can watch our videos all day long and try to go out and implement it and there's going to be certain things that you're just not even registering that you're doing wrong in a massive way that's how the case is for most guys and we're going to be able to put our eyes on it be like boom fix this boom fix this so, you know, the idea is to actually really, really transform you, even though it's a three-day program, we're giving you real transformation, not just sending you in a bunch of approaches and you come yeah. out being like, okay, well, I was forced to approach, you know, 30, 40 girls or whatever, and okay, now I'm going back to fucking up again, right there doing the program. Yeah. That's basically what's happening yeah. on most of these yeah. programs. It's, and then, well, then what happens? They sign up for another one. It's like, you know, that's why they're taking... It's, it's insane taking eight boot camps from a company. It's like, what, what the fuck are you doing, right? It's like... Okay. That, that obviously it's a shitty program. 
Like you're not supposed to take more than one. You're supposed to get it handled and that's it. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, make sure you check the description. That's gonna have all the links. Mm -hmm. The audio is now fixed. There's a pro mic. And so you can all shut the fuck up about the, the pro mic. I think it's still gonna echo a tiny bit because yeah, it's yeah. room, but whatever, yeah. it gives a shit. All right, well, yeah, thanks guys. Appreciate your time. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. All right, take care.